Hey everyone, my name is Danilo Petrovic. I'm Ilya Marchenko. I'm Janis Kuda. I'm Evgeny Donskoy. I'm Henry Laksan. I'm Peter Turepko, and, and you're listening to the Game to Love podcast. trophy for this remarkable young Norwegian a fifth ATP Tour title this year it's a master in Miami and the first from Poland to win a Masters 1000 you are the first Italian to lose your final year at Wimbledon Sunday is a big day for Italian sports congratulations The Russian claims a fourth 500 series event in a row. You try to describe your feeling reaching a 22 years old, your first ever Grand Slam final here in Roland Garros, an incredible achievement. It is a fifth Masters 1000 title for the German, who is just brimming with confidence right now. Unbelievable. Ladies and gentlemen, your champion, the new Medvedev. He has done it. Major title number 20. One six is over. He's gone. Roger and Rafa. Hey, welcome back, tennis fans. Here we are. It's Hubi Herkatch and Alex Zverev in this final match in the well. It's the is the green group, red group, red group, and it is going to be by the looks of it, Herkatch serving first. Uh, I've just uh, literally taken the lunch break uh, so I can bring you this one. Thanks for joining me for it, though. Hubi Herkatch, there's been rumours that he is a bit injured that have been circulating around uh, the circuit. Is it true? We will find out here today. But uh, with two losses on his record, uh, I think his tournament is near enough over. Sasha Zverev, he's going to be looking to, to get a victory here today uh, just to get this one tied up and get his place well and truly sealed in that next round. We had some pretty epic matches yesterday. Last night, alternate Cam Norrie stepped in, didn't he? Stepped in and did a great job, to be honest. I was very impressed with Cam Norrie. Uh, got a good start from Hubert Hercatch here. He's already wincing and uh, already love 40 down. So not a good sign. The crowd trying to get behind him. I think they can see what's going to happen already here. Oh, good backhand here. Looks nearly long, but it's just landed just inside the baseline. Oh, nice forehand there from Zverev. He's just sort of toying with uh, her catch at the moment. Looks like he's just buying his time until he hits the big winner. No, he's still playing with him. Backhand to backhand. They go cross court. Whoa, big winner there from her catch. Great shot. Uh, before we get going, let's get some predictions in. Uh, we should have done it really at the start, shouldn't we? Yes, we should have. What are you, what are you up to, Ben? So let's get those in now. <laughs> So get your predictions in now for the score of this match. Let me know in the live chat who you think is going to win. I'm going to be putting my uh, house on Sasha Zverev here today. Uh, I had him going through from the early stages. He needs the win. I think he gets it done probably in straight sets as well, if I'm honest. I think he just has a little bit too, mu or too, uh, too much for Hubie Hercatch. And there is the first break. And there's a challenge, but not sure this is going to change much. Swear I've already pretty much sat down. Oh, 
Ooh, it was out. There you go. And and it is confirmed that it is the break. Early on already for Sasha. Right. Well, as we know, in this red group, we've had so far 18 games to love. Uh, in the green group, only three behind with 15 games to love in the, uh, the group stages. Let's see if Sasha can add to that total here today. Right. Big serve needed. Good serve down the tee. That was the one he was sort of struggling to find uh, against Medvedev in the first set. Uh, and it turned into a real competitive battle after that. Well, at least Hubert doesn't look like he's wincing anymore. He's starting to hit the ball a bit cleaner now. Oh, good volley there. Down the line, passing shot there from Hubie Hercatch. we got Will Jenkins in saying, I think if Hercatch can hold his nerves and maybe his serves, it could go to three sets. Yeah, he's definitely good uh, if he can push you to a tie break. Just got to be serving well. Has to serve well. We've got Alex there with a 6-4-6-3 for Zverev. Yeah, I think I'm along along those lines as well, to be honest. Good serve there from Zverev. Back in play, but great backhand. Got Hubi on the run. Goes back behind him. The obvious finishing move. Kuninchipali. So it's interesting to have a look in this red group so far. We have Yannick Sinner. Who's got uh well Medvedev two wins out of two he's clearly through Yannick Sinner one win out of one but only one match left uh, and that will be against Medvedev and then Zverev he's one win one loss uh, obviously a victory over Berrettini but it wasn't really a it was sort of a a withdrawal but I still feel like he would have beaten him but it is what it is. So Zverev looking to just get this one done convincingly today, I'm sure. That would really help him progress. In the other group, Novak with the same as Medvedev, leading the way with two wins out of two. Rublev currently in second, Kasper Ruud in third. Cam Norrie down there in a fourth spot. There you go, and it is a consolidation of the break for Sasha. <laughs> nice and easy. Get his button out nice and early for him. Why not? Feeling generous. Sasha, Sasha, Sasha. Nice, nice volley in here from, from Zverev. A terrible drop shot from Hubi Hercatch. It just dropped, barely even made it to the net, that one. Bounced towards the net. That's how much he didn't put on that drop shot. It's sort of like a... I don't know. I don't like the look in the eye of Hubi Hercatch from these first few games, if I'm honest. Good return from Zverev. Oh, he's hooked the forehand wide. Her catch there. It's love 30. So far, not so good from the Polishman. Right. First serve goes in. Zverev with a great return. It's too good. We got three break points already. Wow, uh, the crowd haven't really been treated to uh, to much so far from this match. I'm not going to lie. Who be her catch? Not really arrived yet. Just left his uh, head in the dressing room by the looks of it. 
Looks like he could rather be anywhere else than here on court. And that's wide. And it is a game to love. And Sasha Zvera breaks again. Fantastic. Really, really uh, good stuff for Sasha. Terrible stuff for uh, for Hubi Hercatch. Just looks like a bit of a shell of a man out there on the court. Not really sure what's going on as the Red Group managed to get their 19th game to love of this group stage. Uh, looks like it's going to potentially be an even more comfortable set than we were already thinking. We got Mito in, giving Huber a bit of uh, encouragement there, saying, go Huber. But if Zverev holds serve here, it's a double consolidated break. And not many people come back from that against Sasha Zverev. It's a very few and far between, I'm sure. Interesting stuff. Next, uh, next up this evening, we will be having Daniel Medvedev versus uh, Yannick Sinner. Medvedev, the favourite to win that one there. But Yannick Sinner looked good against Hubi Hercatch. And could he, could with, uh, with the Italian crowd behind him, could Yannick Sinner really pull something out of the bag tonight and get, I think it's going to have to be a convincing win. Uh, I'm not sure if he can even qualify anyway if Zverev wins. Have a look. Let me know in the live chat. Anyway, go oh, fifteen, love. Nice easy one to start off. Oh, here we go. So, someone's written here uh, how he can qualify. Uh, the path to reach the semi-finals is not so plain. He said, funny enough, even Alex Zverev got per perplexed over the young Italian semi-final chances in, in Turin. So it says, <clears throat> oh, it's a nice one. It says, so far, Russian uh, Medvedev has won both of his matches uh, and confirmed his place in the semi-finals. It came uh, as an effect of Italian star Berrettini's unfortunate withdrawal. Yep, interestingly, Zverev have received a walkover of Berrettini on day one. Now, if he manages to defeat Hercatch, he will take the second spot. Okay, that's what I thought. Uh, the only hope that Sinner has is if Hercatch wins here today. Okay, as long as we've got that. Right, Zverev with a consolidated break. <laughs> Yeah, apparently for her catch. Well, this was before. It said for her catch to uh, go through, he needs to beat Zverev and Medvedev to beat Sinner. Interesting. Zverev looking very, very uh, on top in this match, though. <clears throat> now Mina saying, so Karatsev came for nothing. <laughs> Quite possibly, mate. <laughs> oh, a good shot there from her catch. Forces out a good shot, finally. Quinici Zero. Maybe Kolatsev uh, just came for a change of scenery. Didn't want to be on holiday in Israel anymore. Just wide from Zverev there. <clears throat> Is he letting him back in here? A bit of charity from Sasha Zverev. Here we go. Serving. Down the tee. Let first serve. Second serve. Out wide. Great return from Sasha Zverev. It's a winner, clean winner as well. Thirty fifteen. 
Could we see a bagel here? Have to wait and see. Second serve anyway, he gets to have a look at. And her catches first serve points one, only 29% at the moment. Great return from Zverev on the backhand side this time. Now forcing him left and right. Great shot into the opposite corner. Now forehand down the line. Takes on the drive volley, but a terrible drive volley from Zverev. He had him where he wanted him. Almina saying, do alternates get paid? Because if so, that's a great holiday <laughs> for Karatsa. Yeah, it really is. Surely they must. They can't just get them to fly over there on their own accord, uh, spend their own money, and then not give them any money. Maybe they just let them have a holiday instead. Who knows? Oh, he comes to the net. Oh, good volley in here from her catch. Not there, though. Zverev tries to pass and uh, just plops it into the net there. Her catch, he was on the stretch. 40-30. And her catch still after that first game. Uh, can he hold to get it himself on the board here? Otherwise, it's going to be a very quick day at the office for Sasha Zverev. Nice forehand from her catch. Responded. A drop shot. Zverev's in. Oh, he's overcooked it. And he does have his first one. His first game of the match. Matthew saying just tuned in. What a nightmare for Hubi. Is he injured? I don't know. There were some sort of signs of grimacing on his face in the first game of the match. Don't know if that was just from his poor play and he was just annoyed. There you go, RS jumping in Elmino. He got 93,000 US dollars, mate. And I'm pretty sure he came for the free accommodation to, to in, or enter in. Well, well done to Karatsev just for turning up. Really good stuff. We got Matthew saying this highlights what a stupid decision it was to have this, ma this match first. Now Sinner versus Medvedev is a dead rubber. Yeah. Does it doesn't make much sense to uh to have that with it or well, that this one first? I totally agree with you. And the other match, yeah, means literally nothing. Just just playing for pride or money as well if you're the players. But and thanks to this person saying a commentator is thank you. Very match. See you tomorrow. Oh, well, see you today and tomorrow. All right, well, Zverev serving for a 5-1 lead here. If you are just joining and you haven't hit the like on the video yet, help the channel out, hit the like button. Let's try and get this up to, yeah, let's try and get up to 50 likes as quick as we can. Yeah, and so Edward saying 200 points in the rankings uh, uh, for people who do manage to get a win i believe here so always worth getting you can move yourself up those rankings strange in the women's one you just get points for losing as well very interesting misses the first serve down the tee second serve here for sasha zverev i mean the crowd I'm sure they'd love to see a more of a spectacle here. It returns back in. Her catch. Oh, it's another terrible drop shot. It's the second really bad one that he's done today. That barely made the net. Uh, I think he needs to cut those out of his uh, game instantly. He's not going to be winning any matches with those drop shots. Good serve down the tee. Too powerful. And it is 40 love, Sasha Zverev. Oh, here we go. First serve. Can he get another game to love? It's up in the air. It's, there you go. It's miles long. And it is 20th game to love of the red group. Well done to Sasha.
And now Harkach serving to stay in the first set. 17 minutes on the clock. Long return from Zverev. 15 love. Interested to see these two's head to head. They've only played once before. And they played in Madrid in 2019, and it was three sets, and Zverev won in three. So it was 3 6, 6 4, 6 4 on that day. And that tournament was uh, won by, I believe, Novak Djokovic. Oh, good volley in here from her catch. And again, but Zverev, he's got quick reflexes, wins the volley battle at the net. And it's 15.30, and Herkatch just sort of puffs out his cheek to say, what am I supposed to do? Will say, 17 minutes on the clock and 17 likes. Well, close, close. It's, it's pretty close, I have to say. I think we got 31 now, mate. <laughs> Let's get 17 more. All right. Well, 30 all. Two points away for Zverev here from this first set. Trying to dish out a breadstick. Nice forehand cross court. And now down the line, her catch. Just being moved around so well here by Zverev. He's oh, it's into the net. We got set point. <clears throat> well, Matthew saying this tournament shaping up as predicted. Aside from Steph not qualifying, Zverev versus Novak semi and the final between <laughs> Nola and uh, and Med. Well, that's all. That... Zverev's not an easy opponent, so I don't think that's a, a given. The semi final will be. Much more tricky, I'm sure, than Medvedev's. Medvedev will either have Andre Rublev or Kasper Ruud. Don't think Cam Norrie can make it through now. Oh, nice ace down the tee from her catch. There's life in the old dog yet. Can he get at least a second game on the board here in this first set and at least prevent Zverev serving first in the second set. Trying to play it predominantly into Zverev's backhand, but we know what a weapon that can be. And the forehand's even... Whoa, it's being challenged. It is called in, but Herkatch wants to challenge. I thought it might have clipped the back edge of the line. Yes, it did. Half in. Half of the ball. Well, it's just slightly less than half the ball in. Guys, if you're just joining, one of the 120, hit a like on the video as soon as you come in. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Hubert Hercatch, back to juice, serving into the net. Yeah, if you want some extra tennis content, some interviews, join our Patreon. We just interviewed Francisco Serendolo on there. So a very, very good one. Down the line there from Hercatch into the net from Zverev. It's a bit of a strange rally, that one. Neither player hitting the ball particularly well. And now the crowd making that stupid noise. First serve misses from her catch. I'm sure Zverev would like, well, how crazy this game itself has taken a, near, a great serve. And that looks like it's long it is. And there you go. Hercatch gets on the board again. 5-2. Go on, I'll give him a little button just to cheer him up. Hubert Hercatch gets his second game of the day and... Well, it's Zverev going to be serving for the first set. Coming back, we're only 22 minutes done. But that last game was five minutes in its entirety, I believe. So that was took up nearly a, a quarter of that whole for, of the whole first set. Yeah, it's been pretty much plain sailing for Sasha Zverev, though, on his serve. Two games to love so far. 
pretty decent. Do you think there's? A, let me know in the live chat. Do you think there's any way back here for her catch, or do you think Zverev's just gonna get this done six two and then cream him in the second set as well? Yeah, I agree with RS. He's clearly not a hundred percent. Mostly errors when chasing the ball. Why not let Karatsev play? We want to see the lion. Uh, it might be a uh, the financial income that you get from just playing a match is $173,000. So maybe that's uh, swayed his decision. Just turn up and just give it uh, the best you can, but sort of deep down knowing that you're not physically fit enough to beat Zverev. It's not really good for the crowd. Snail saying, and now starts the comeback. Well, let's see. Is it possible? Zverev checking, see if he's ready. <clears throat> Great first serve. It is an ace from Sasha Zverev. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Great serve down the tee. Nice forehand winner from Sasha Zverev. Yeah, exactly. Tanking without tanking, Ben. Yeah. Seems a little bit like that receiving a paycheck today. Zverev just doing what he has to do. Oh, ball boy missed the catch. Second serve. Where's this going to go? Goes down the tee. Her catch gets it in play. For me, if you're Zverev, just maneuver him around the court. Good shot there from her catch and a nice slice there. It's into the net, and it is 30-15. There's a little bit of sign of life there from her catch. Just doesn't have a particularly happy look on his face. That's the problem. Just looks troubled. Anyway, let's see how he receives this one, if he even gets a, a look at this ball before it flies past him. No, he doesn't. Ace, two set points. 26 minutes on the clock and we have our first uh, set point here as the lights dim and the big set point sounds. Good serve out wide. Her catch is long and there you go. Bill R, one of our patrons, turns up just to see Sasha seal the first set. Well done to him. Sasha! 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 Yeah, guys and girls, if you are just joining and you're one of the 140 people, please hit a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We'll be bringing you all the rest of the action from the ATP Tour Finals uh, coming up over the next few days. Still some exciting matches left to play, that's for sure. Uh, we've obviously got Rude, Rublev, then we've got the semi-finals and then a potential uh, final don't know who's going to be there yet. A lot of people probably have Novak and uh, Medi in there, but what can you do? Uh, I don't think, I don't think you should rule out someone like Zverev though. He's already got a win over Novak on the hard courts this year, but well, it's not the same conditions. But you'd say maybe is it more favourable conditions for Zverev being the indoor hard court rather than being outdoor in. Uh, where was it? In Tokyo? So, right. Let me just uh, have a quick look on here. We can find out what other tennis we've got coming up as well. We had the women's. They were playing last night. Uh, well done to Garbina Mugolutsa. She wins the World Tour Finals against Annette Kontovi. Very uh, impressive display. She beat her twice in the tournament as well, in straight sets both times. 
uh, proving that she is uh, the person to walk away with the trophy and all the money as well, which is a very, very hefty financial reward for winning the World Tour Finals, that's for sure. Some other matches coming up today. We've got both the Serendolos are in action later on in Brazil. We've got Francisco. He's up against uh, Melegeni Alves. And then we've got Juan Manuel up later on this evening. Her catch to start us off serving first. And he starts off with an ace. Will we see a better showing in this second set? The only poor thing for her catch, uh, unfortunately, is his third set percentage of wins is the lowest out of all of the players here at the tour finals at 42%. So the chances of him winning in three are not great, but might be able to give us a third set though. Ace. There you go. He's serving well now. Where's that been? Finally. Maybe he just gave the, the gave up on the first set after being four love down. Thought I'll, I'll I'll save my energy. Good first serve there. Good return from Zverev. Inside out forehand. Now he's got her catch on the run, left to right. Oh, good return from her catch there with the backhand. Now he's running into the net. Can Sasha pass him? Doesn't have to. The volley goes into the net. Not like her catch to miss a volley like that. Bill said, <laughs> I hope, hope uh, Francisco packed his bag properly. Yeah, when we spoke to Francisco Serendolo on, uh, during the interview, he was showing us how he packs his tennis bag uh, and all of the interesting items that he has in there. Ace from Hubie Hercatch. Great start to the second set. Get your dance moves out, Hoobie. Sorry, having a little bite on some lunch. It's always a good opportunity when the buttons go on. Zverev to serve. One love, her catch. Misses down the tee. I mean, all her catch needs is Zverev to just go off the boil a little bit. He definitely has a chance here. Good return. Zverev steps in. Big forehand, cross court. Good volley from Zverev. He's looped up the lob. It's long, though. An orchid panda in saying, good morning. Good morning to you. How is Hubi looking? First set, not great. Bit negative. But second set, started all right. So far, so good. How long will it last, though? Good serve out wide. There you go. 15 or no, 30 love. Sorry. Excuse me. Great serve. Unreturnable. Her catch just stuck a racket out and it just uh, pinged off. Where's this serve going to go? Goes out wide. Her catch. Good return. Winner down the line. Oh, look at that. Very, very convincing hitting from Sasha Zverev. Trying to work if I'm central. Ooh. That works a bit better. All right. This is the first serve. Second serve for Sasha Zverev. Looking for another game to love. How many does he get, this guy? Backhand to Hubie's forehand. Hubie's got him running. There's the drop shot. There's the winner. And it is game to love for Sasha Zverev once again. <laughs> Guys, if you want the chance to get on our top tippers leaderboard, this is running uh, throughout the ATP Tour Finals. Uh, 
if you send in ten dollars, then you can have a player button of your choice. And if you get high enough in the top tippers, then uh, you'll be eligible for prizes come to come our end of year awards as well. We've got some very interesting giveaways in there. There's some real cool tennis uh, products as well. Oh, good serve down the tee from her catch. Backhand to backhand rally. Always hit the net cord, but it hasn't affected the flight too much. Good forehand shot back in play and a nice drive volley from her catch there. Giving the crowd a little bit, a little bit of something extra. Got Bill asking, uh, in 2022, do you and JG plan on traveling to any international tennis events? Yes, we do. That is something that we've been wanting to do. We actually had our first one planned just before the the whole uh, pandemic kicked off. Um, unfortunately, we didn't, well, fortunately, we didn't book it. We were just about to. We were in the week of booking it. And then everything, we all got sent home from work and had to stay at home. And the whole thing blew up. Um, unfortunately, yeah. So we want to get back to that. We want to be going to some events. We got some, uh, it's probably a blessing in disguise, I'd say, because now we're actually in, back then we were, I don't know how many, we were probably about a thousand subscribers. Now we have uh, a bigger uh, base and we've got more contacts that we can use to uh, to network with to be able to get us uh, access to different things, different events. So yeah, you will be seeing us. We're planning on going to uh, some other bits and pieces very soon, maybe the back end of this year as well. So if there's any tennis events out there, we'll be trying to get our foot in the door and try and bring you some exclusive tennis content uh for patreon as well uh but ultimately the goal is to be getting uh some extra things on the channel like some vlogs and some uh maybe some practice tennis pra like practice uh, hitting some interviews loads of different bits and pieces that we want to do just to uh make it more engaging for you guys uh, everybody wants to see behind the behind the scenes uh with all these tennis players and that's what we want to bring you we want to uh like i said get our foot in the door i'm sure once we're in we're nice enough guys that hopefully people will want to converse with us and uh get give us some content for the channel oh rs saying davis cup ben in madrid saves sounds really good to me well we'll have to see how uh, our contacts, uh, how much they can sort us out. So, all right, Sasha serving two one down. Nice, or oh, just just long on the first serve there. Nice slice there from Zvera, but oh, just long. So love fifteen. Yeah, let us know of any other uh, tennis events around Europe that uh, you think would be well worth us going to or covering. I think we'd probably have to start the smaller events to start with, but like a 250 or even some good challenges as well. We really want to bring the challenger tour to everyone's attention. And uh, hopefully we can bring you some interviews with some very good up and coming tennis players. Oh, let not an ace down the tee. First serve for Sasha here. Great serve, good return, and it's into the net from Zverev here. He's sort of gone off the boil a little bit. Sort of like the rhythm has been disrupted by her by her catch. There's been a few slow points that have uh, had to play out unforced errors 
Only uh, four for Zverev so far, 11 for her catch. Great serve, and wow, massive shank off the racket of her catch. Yeah. All right, 30 all. Great serve out wide. Hercatch just keeps it in the court, but it's fired back behind him. Great hits in from Zverev. 40-30. Yeah, guys, if you haven't hit the like on the video yet, we're up to 52. Let's try and get to 100 so I can get the special 100 likes button out. Come on, I want to press it. Ace from Zverev, and it is two games all, just like that. <laughs> Yeah, if you guys want to uh, help support the channel a little bit more, maybe get yourself some uh, GTL merch. Underneath the uh, video, there's a little uh, link to there. You can just have a click on that, have a look for our little collection that we put together. Christmas coming up. Ace from her catch. Oh, the crowd trying to get her catch going here a little bit, trying to give him a little bit of a, say, kick up the arse, but he needs it at the minute. All right, second serve. Good return from Zverev. It's long from her catch. Bit of a waste there. You see the face of frustration once more from Hubie Hercatch as he just goes, mm, mm, should have done better. Mm, really should have. Oh, good serve there, though. <laughs> Williams then. A kick up the backside. Yeah, I think he does. It seems like Karatsev, if he was there, he'd give him a kick right up there. Say, so let, let me on the court. I want to play. Oh, good serve in there from her catch. Sasha complaining about it. He's either complaining about it or he's just saying, what am I supposed to do about it? Good serve down the tee. It's an ace. Her catch serving well here in this second set. Is that a bad sign for Sasha Zverev, though? Her catch finally turns up. Well done to who be playing better. <laughs>Fix now, that's what I like to hear. Got Massimo in saying, uh, Forza Hubi supporting the Polishman who just looks a little bit, he's just staring into space, sat on the uh, sat on the seat. Doesn't really look like he's uh, enjoying himself out there today. Not sure who he's looking to, they're showing just outside the arena now. Is they're gonna bring the camera through the curtain. This is from the very top level by the looks of it. Yeah. Nice view of the Nitto ATP finals. It is gonna be Zverev serving. Bill saying <laughs> then I checked on the much. But you know. I know, Bill, I know. Need to find some time to do this. Literally, the the calendar uh, every day is so filled at the moment. I just have no. Well, I think in this off season, it's going to uh, at least help a little bit with creating some stuff. At the moment, 
with the day job and doing this on lunch breaks and then finishing work and then doing the other match and then pretty much it's time to go to bed after that there's no spare time Oh, good rally here, though. Oh, just wide down the line from Hubi. That's 40 love. Zverev. Sure, he'd love to get out of this uh, second set pretty quickly, get it done and dusted. Yeah, I agree with Snail saying, her catch needs a bit of the Aslam roar for the energy. Needs something. Oh, it's a terrible forehand from Zverev there. Loops long, shakes his head as if to say, What the hell was that? 40 15, no game to love for him there. Oh, he comes to the net. Good volley. Her catch gets there. It's in. Well done, Hooby. Showing some signs of life. And Sasha, from a comfortable position at 40 love, is now 40 30, but he can extinguish that flame with just a simple service, as we know. How many likes are we on the video, guys? 55. Come on, let's get this up to 100. There's 170 of you in. Everybody hit that button and everybody subscribe if you haven't already. Sverev, second serve. Is he going to go big? That's the question. He doesn't, and it's a winner from her catch. And we're back to juice. What's the Zverev up to here? Is he just giving the fans something? Just to, uh, feels a bit bad that people have paid money. Wants to give him another set? Wants to give him a longer set? I don't know. What, what's happened to him here? Good serve down the tee, and there you go. Normal service resumes, but he's going to challenge by the looks of it. Her catch. Is he? No, he's not challenging. Advantage Zverev from such a advantageous position. He's now... There you go. A nice ace and all the hope extinguished, but the racket of Sasha Zverev and the big, powerful serve. Three all. Back to you. Her catch. See if your serving can uh, put the pressure back onto Zverev again. This second set so far has been 20 minutes. First serve into the net. And Hubi, as you can see, 65% of his first serve points of, of his one. Not the highest compared to Zverev, 90%. But as long as he holds serve, that's all that matters. Both players, second serve, points one. Pretty poor, to be honest. We'll reckon maybe his coffee's just kicked in. <laughs> oh, good return there from Zverev. Just blocked it back now. An amazing backhand down the line. Looks like that's going wide. Fifteen all. Zverev, it's when he opens up that backhand, it's a dangerous weapon. Hits it so flat, misses the first serve there. Her catch. Second serve, it's in play. Good return from Zverev. He's on the stretch. Great depth, and her catch has hooked it wide. Oh, we got Davina back in. How you doing, Davina? Over in Mauritius. Love in life. And we got 15.30. A chance here for Sasha Zverev. Ice from her catch. The crowd respond. Oh, Jebish. Yeah, if Zverev wins, the next match means nothing. Yeah, he goes second in the group. Oh, nice forehand. Zverev stays in the rally, though. That's long, and it is. Break point, Sasha Zverev. 
Snail reckons that Hubie needs some of JG's Vamoses right now. I think he does. Where are you, JG? Oh, he's in the office. He's working today. Somewhere I'll be going back to as soon as this match is over. Just misses down the tee there. Backhand loops up. Nice forehand winner from her catch. Really good hitting. Jebish says, is it unfair on Sinner if he wins tonight and he still goes out? There's nothing not much you can do about it, I'm afraid. That's just the rules of rules. Should have got into the tournament proper, shouldn't he? Then he might have had more to say about it. Smashed away there from Hubi Hercatch. Saves a break point, and now he's got advantage. Up to 58 likes on the video. Apologies that the, uh, the energy is not uh, as high as the evening matches today. Just been a very busy morning at work. And this match, they need to uh, up the level a bit. There you go. It's into the net. Hubi does hold. That's a big hold as well for him. Very, very well done. Wow, well done. Hubie Hercatch face break point, but did manage to save his own bacon there. Now he's on to the number four. Can Sverev join him and make this a business end set? We got Tahar in saying, hi, guys. Thanks from Montreal, Canada. Well, wow, great to have you in. What time is it over there? What time is it where everybody is uh, watching or listening from? Always good to know. Bill saying it's great you're doing this during the work day. Yeah, it's very hectic. I'm not going to lie. Doing this on a lunch break and going straight back to work again. Got my work laptop placed beside me on this side. Just keeping an eye in case something urgent comes through. <laughs> but I'm still... Uh, Still in the clear at the moment, I think. But I'm sure there's going to be plenty to get on with as soon as this is over. 9 a.m. where you are, Bill. So just starting the work day. Oh, RSN kind of sucks. Last night in the WTA Finals trophy ceremony, they didn't address the hashtag where is Pong Shui issue. Hmm, yeah, the... That is a little bit disappointing. That would have been an ideal opportunity to actually get that get that out there. Obviously, the tournament was supposed to be in China as well, in Shenzhen. Ended up being in Guadalajara. But well done to Mugalutsa. Did well. I think she just likes those hot conditions. And to Harv, appreciate the kind words, mate. Saying I said it before, and I'll say it again. I love this podcast. You're amazing. Appreciate that, mate. One AM here. Are well, you both in the same place? Pierce uh, Wreck and Will Jenkins. Oh, love fifteen opportunity knocks for who be her catch? Can Zverev just hold serve here? Just force himself uh, over the line in this second set. God, oh, what a serve. Her, her catch is going to challenge. Go oh, so quick, it's hard to even know. Could be in. The umpire says he might be right. He is right. Second serve. Good challenge from the big Polish man. Good return here from Hercatch. He spotted the opportunity and he takes it. It's love 30. It 
So the interesting thing here is if uh, her catch beats Zverev and Medvedev defeats Sinner, then her catch has a chance of going through. Oh, but not with backhands like that into the net. All right, 15.30. Yeah, look, reading Jose Morgado's tweet, and he was saying, I hope that they schedule Medvedev Sinner first. It would have made more sense. <clears throat> Great shot there from Zverev. Puts it away. It's 30 all. But guys, if you're just joining us for this matchup, 61 likes on the video. If you're one of the people who hasn't hit the like button yet, make sure to do so right this second. Come on, it really helps our channel uh, with those YouTube algorithms, helps us move up through the, the video rankings. Uh, subscribe as well. Why not while you're here? Massive uh, serve down the tee. And he's challenging that one as well. Hoobie's just getting in while he can. I think that one looked in to me, though. Yeah, clearly in that one. Cool stands. 40-30 oh, to Zverev right now. Looking to send us into a business end here in this second set. Where is he going to put the first serve? Down the tee? Yes, he does. There it is. And it is a four games all. And we're going into the business end. Very, very big serve in there from Sasha. Very well played. Sasha, Sasha, Sasha. Crowd just getting involved. Right, for all. Could this be last chance saloon? Misses the first serve. Well, New South Wales for uh, William Jenkins. And we got Orange, New South Wales. Sydney City for William. Interesting. 15 love. 15 love here. Where's he going to put this first serve? Or into the net by the looks of it. Second serve. Got anything better you want to do with that? Good one. It's a kick. Oh, what a great uh, shot from Zverev. He saw him coming in and played it. A great shot down the line. Her catch on the stretch couldn't get the volley back into court, into the net again. We got Gio Su saying, uh, sorry if the pronunciation is wrong, saying, come on, Hubert. Got 15 all. Misses the first serve, though. Whoa, good serve out wide. He's opened the court up. Oh, he's just missed that. But he's, I would challenge that. Bill saying, what are the odds that JG is listening to this podcast rather than working? Not very high, unfortunately. Uh, he'll be in the office at his new job. Uh, I think it's he's going to have to be very focused there. I spoke to him on his lunch break. That's the only time that he's uh, out and on his phone. All right, 15.30, second serve. Oh, a good looping return. It's long. It's two break points. What a time to make the error and Hercatch lifts his shirt up over his head almost to say, oh, and the Orchid Pan saying, breathe, Hubi, breathe. we got JJ Greek saying, I can't stand Zverev, a whiny little boy. who's Whoever he's losing, he stirs up imaginary conspiracy theories like long bathroom breaks, imaginary illegal coaching, 
or illegal cell phone use. <laughs> PS Rex said, I have a sinking feeling. This is Zverev in straight sets. Well, Hoob is still serving. Good return here from her. From Zverev, he's staying in this rally. It's hit wide from her catch there. Poor, very poor. <laughs> terrible, terrible shot. Uh, what a way to end that game. Uh, not sure what to say really about that. Thought he could have done a lot better. Uh, a bit disappointed. Nevertheless... Uh, we'll, we've got Sasha serving for the match. Let's see if we can get 32 more likes before Sasha serves out for this match. We're uh, on 68. We want to get to 100 and appreciate everyone who hits the like button and helps us him reach that target. Subscribe to the channel if you are new as well because we're trying to hit this little target down below me uh, and hopefully we can get there at some point soon. Uh, we're not doing too bad. 21,148 at the moment. So bit by bit, we're getting there. Oh, uh, we all really appreciate uh, you helping us achieve, uh, achieve our dream. We've got RS saying, JG is still doing some accounting in the new job. Yes, he is. And so JG working with Focus and his boss is enjoying the GTL podcast. Maybe. Quite possibly. <laughs> Who knows? All right. Zverev steps out onto the court. Here we go. This second set has been 33 minutes long. And Zverev now serving for it. He's been threatening. He's had more break points. Uh, Zverev and uh, Hubert Hercatch doesn't have one break point the entire match. Well, RSN clearly it's 6 2, 6 4 in exactly one hour. Great return there from Hercatch. He's not done yet. Love 15. Zverev's going to have to get first serves in here because it looks like. Her catch is on the warpath. He's just going to just try and leather some of these returns. All right, love 15. Great serve. It's back into play. Zverev can tighten up sometimes as well. Nice backhand from her catch. It seems that he's, uh, he's forgotten about the fact that he's down by a break and he is now on love 30. He's playing with total freedom now. Exactly. Orchid Panda, he's got nothing to lose. Really doesn't. Just got to go for it. Serve down the tee. It's an ace. Brilliant ace as well. 15.30, still only three points away here from this match. See if he can get it done. It's a big point, this one. 15.30. Ooh. It was sort of a shout, but I'm not sure. Half-hearted shout. Oh, great body serve. He put a lot of power into that second serve, and Hercatch had stepped in uh, inside the baseline. It's just... Literally, he just hit him. His, his, well, hit his racket. He didn't have any say in it. 30 all. Sverev saying, mind your P's and Q's. You think you're just going to step in on my second serve again? I'll fire a first serve at you. Misses his first serve here, though. But Hercatch has to be wary now. That second serve can sometimes be the same pace as a first. Nice, nice long on the return from her catch, and it is match point. Match point. Match point, Sasha Zverev. One serve, and it will be through to the semi finals where he'll face Novak Djokovic. And then there you go, all done and dusted. He does consolidate his break.
Well done, Sasha. Sasha, Sasha, Sasha. So Sasha Zverev there through to the semi-finals of the Nitto ATP finals. He will be facing Novak Djokovic uh, in those semi-finals. We will find out. Well, the, there's a dead dead rubber match that's going to be later. It means nothing now. It's going to be Medvedev versus uh, Yannick Sinner. Bit sad that that match now is. Well, you've got some points to play for and some money to play for, but. Ultimately, nothing else. Uh, the only other match which means anything now left in the tournament is Andre Rublev versus Kasper Ruud. And that one will be tomorrow. Uh, and I believe that one will be tomorrow. I haven't put the time out yet, but it would make more sense just, well, I guess they can put it on whenever they want. It doesn't really matter. They can... Uh, I would put it on the evening match if I was, if I'm honest, just to make it a bit more entertaining for for the evening session. But wait and see. Uh, Djokovic playing Cam Norrie, obviously. Don't, that one doesn't mean anything. But you never know. Cam Norrie picks up a few more points. What more can you do? All right, I'm going to go back to work anyway. Cheers, everybody. You did join me for this one. It was fun while it lasted. Uh, if you haven't already, already said it many times, hit a like on the video. Really helps the channel out. Subscribe if you're new. And uh, I'll see you uh, on the next one. So, see you later, guys. Mm -hmm.